The quest to connect oneself to the universe is not merely an intellectual endeavor. It is a deeply spiritual and philosophical pursuit that has echoed through the ages, transcending geographical boundaries and cultural divides. It's a yearning etched into the very fabric of our being, a longing to find our place in the grand scheme of existence. This pursuit is not confined to the annals of religious texts or the teachings of mystics and sages. It is a journey that belongs to each of us, calling us to seek a deeper understanding of the cosmos and our role within it. At the heart of this quest lies the desire to transcend the egoic self, the aspect of our identity that is tethered to the material world defined by personal desires, fears, and social conditioning. This is no small feat, for the ego is a formidable adversary, skilled in illusion and deception. Yet, the journey beyond the ego is where the true adventure begins, leading us to a state of awareness where the individual and the universe merge into a harmonious whole. Across the vast expanse of human history, this journey has been undertaken by countless souls, each contributing their unique thread to the universal tapestry of spirituality and philosophy. From the ancient Vedas of India to the mystical teachings of Rumi, from the contemplative practices of Buddhist monks to the profound dialogues of Plato, the quest for connection with the universe has been a unifying theme, a shared endeavor that transcends the boundaries of time and place. This rich mosaic of spiritual and philosophical traditions offers us a treasure trove of wisdom and insight, guiding us on our path. Yet, the essence of this journey is not found in dogma or doctrine, but in the direct experience of transcending the self and touching the infinite. The egoic self, with its incessant demands and fears, often stands as a barrier to our quest for connection with the universe. It is a construct of our minds shaped by societal norms, personal experiences, and the relentless pursuit of self-gratification. The ego thrives on separation, convincing us that we are isolated entities competing in a world of scarcity. Transcending the ego is akin to shedding a heavy cloak that has obscured our vision and weighed us down. It is a process of letting go, of releasing the attachments and identities that have defined us. This is not an act of self-denial, but an awakening to a more expansive sense of self, one that recognizes our interconnectedness with all existence. As we embark on this journey, we are invited to awaken to a greater awareness, an awareness that encompasses both the microcosm of our individual existence and the macrocosm of the universe. This is not a passive awareness, but an active dynamic force that propels us forward on our path. In this state of expanded consciousness, we come to understand that we are not merely observers of the universe, but active participants in its unfolding story. We are not separate from the cosmos. We are a part of it, woven into its fabric with every breath we take. This realization opens up a new way of being in the world, a way that is not confined by the limitations of the egoic self. We begin to see through the illusions that have held us captive, recognizing the unity that underlies the apparent diversity of existence. To connect with the universe, we must first embark on the journey within, to the core of our being where awareness resides. This journey is not about acquiring new knowledge or adhering to a set of external practices. It is about rediscovering the essence of who we are. Awareness is the key that unlocks the door to the universe. It is not something we need to seek outside of ourselves. It is an intrinsic part of our nature, waiting to be acknowledged 
and embraced. As we cultivate awareness, we begin to perceive the world with new eyes, seeing beyond the surface appearances to the underlying unity that connects all things. The practice of presence is central to our quest for connection with the universe. To be present is to fully inhabit the moment, to experience life as it unfolds with an open heart and a clear mind. This is the realm of pure awareness, where the past and future lose their grip on us, and we are free to experience the richness of the now. In the state of presence, the egoic mind, with its constant chatter and distractions, begins to quieten. We find ourselves more attuned to the subtleties of existence, more receptive to the whispers of the universe. The present moment becomes a gateway to the infinite, a space where we can connect with the timeless wisdom that underlies all creation. Letting go of the ego is perhaps one of the greatest challenges we face on our journey. The ego with its fears and desires, its need for control and recognition can be a tenacious force resisting our efforts to transcend it. Yet the art of letting go is not about suppression or denial. It is about understanding and acceptance. It is about recognizing the ego for what it is, a construct of the mind, and choosing to step beyond its limitations. This process requires patience, compassion, and a deep trust in the wisdom of the universe. As we let go of the ego, we open ourselves to a deeper connection with the universe. We become more aligned with the flow of life, more responsive to the guidance of a higher intelligence. We discover a sense of freedom and expansiveness that transcends the confines of the individual self. The ultimate goal of our quest is not just to connect with the universe, but to recognize that we are an integral part of it. This is the realization that brings us full circle, back to the essence of who we are. In this state of union, the distinction between the individual and the universe fades away, revealing the interconnectedness of all existence. We come to see ourselves not as isolated beings, but as expressions of a greater whole, participants in the cosmic dance of creation. This realization is not the end of the journey, but a new beginning a stepping stone to a deeper exploration of the mysteries of existence. And it is an invitation to live with a sense of wonder and awe, to embrace the adventure of being alive in a universe that is vast, mysterious, and infinitely beautiful. As we deepen our connection with the universe, we learn to navigate the world with a new sense of awareness. We become more attuned to the rhythms of life, more responsive to the needs of the moment. Our actions are no longer driven by the egoic mind, but are guided by a higher intelligence that operates in harmony with the universe. This does not mean that life becomes free of challenges or difficulties. On the contrary, we may encounter obstacles and setbacks along the way. But with a deeper connection to the universe, we approach these challenges with a sense of clarity and purpose. We understand that they are part of the journey, opportunities for growth and learning. One of the most powerful practices on our journey is the cultivation of gratitude. Gratitude opens our hearts to the abundance of the universe, allowing us to see the beauty and wonder that surround us. It shifts our focus from what we lack to what we have from scarcity to abundance. Practicing gratitude is not about denying the challenges or difficulties of life. It is about acknowledging them and choosing to focus on the blessings that are present in every moment. This shift in perspective can transform our experience of the world, filling our hearts with joy and appreciation. As we continue our journey, we come to discover the essence of our true self, this is not the self that is defined by our roles, achievements, or possessions. It is the self that exists beyond the ego, the self that is connected to the universe. Discovering this essence 
is like uncovering a tree sure that has been hidden within us all along. It is a source of light and wisdom, a guiding force that leads us on our path. As we connect with this essence, we find a sense of peace and fulfillment that is not dependent on external circumstances. One of the greatest gifts of our journey is the realization of the power of the present moment. The present is where life happens, where the universe unfolds in all its glory. It is the only time that is truly ours, the only time we can experience the fullness of being. Living in the present moment is an art, a practice that requires mindfulness and awareness. It is about letting go of the past and the future, about being fully engaged with the here and now. This practice opens us to the beauty and wonder of existence, allowing us to experience the universe in its fullness. The quest to connect with the universe is not a destination, but a journey, a never-ending exploration of the mysteries of existence. It is a path that leads us deeper into the heart of the cosmos, revealing the interconnectedness of all life. As we continue on this path, we are called to live with a sense of wonder and awe, to embrace the adventure of being alive in a universe that is vast, mysterious, and infinitely beautiful. This journey is an invitation to explore the depths of our being, to discover the light within, and to connect with the universe in a profound and meaningful way. In conclusion, the journey to connect with the universe is a profound exploration that invites us to transcend the ego, embrace awareness, and discover our true essence. It is a path of transformation that leads us to a deeper connection with the cosmos, a journey that reminds us of the beauty and wonder of existence. As we embark on this journey, we are called to live with a sense of purpose and intention to navigate the world with wisdom and compassion and to embrace the adventure of being alive in this vast and mysterious universe. Let us journey together with open hearts and curious minds as we explore the timeless quest to connect with the universe and discover the boundless potential within us all.